How come we have no sound? This is Mrs. Kazmarek and George, my assistant today. He's going to help us learn how to draw a hummingbird. And the hummingbird is Little Green from the story Little Green we read last class. And the last time in class, we drew Little, little Green's movements. Looked something like this. And this is called abstract art. What do you think, George? Do you like it? Mm -hmm. And in abstract art, it's a lot of color and movement and lines. And we drew Little Green's movements to make a beautiful work of art. So today, we're going to draw Little Green. And when we're done, your art's going to look something like this. We're going to have a beautiful abstract art piece and a hummingbird like Little Green. George, are you ready to draw Little Green? Where's Little Green at? Right there. Good job. What color is Little Green? Uh, green. Yeah, he's green. So, to begin, I'm going to use a Sharpie marker. Are you going to use a Sharpie too, George? Mm -hmm. Yep, we're going to use a Sharpie so you can see. And I'm using this paper here. And you're going to use a pencil because if you mess up, then you can... Hold on. Hold on. Okay. If you mess up, then you can erase it. So, here you got your paper. You ready to begin? Mm -hmm. Okay. So we're going to start with Little Green's head. And we're going to draw a circle on our paper. Not humongous, but also not teensy, teensy, tiny either. Okay. Can you draw me a circle? Good job. Love it. Okay. So now mommy's going to draw, okay? Mm -hmm. Okay. So we're going to draw a circle for the head. Okay. And then we're going to add little green's body. And look, green kind of reminds me of a seahorse. Looks something like that. It's kind of silly. Maybe it's like a bug shape or like almost like a butterfly, isn't it, George? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then we're going to add the wings. And the wings are going to come out. Little wing there. And a little wing here. Will you draw again? Hold on. You wait a minute, okay? Yeah. All right. Now, little green's wings are a lot bigger than that. That's actually just the top of the wing. So we need to add some more. So we're going to come a line down here. And a line down here. Oh, that's lovely, honey. Drawing on my art. Now, I have these lines here, and I can't erase them because I did not use a pencil, but you will get to erase those lines. Hold on, honey. You can do it down there. That's fine. Good job. Beautiful abstract art. Or is that little green? Little green. Little green? Okay. Yeah. Now, little green has an awesome hummingbird beak, so it's really long and skinny. And I'm going to even color it in with my Sharpie. He's got a Sharpie right here. Yep. His eye is nice and big and cute. So I draw my circle. And then I draw another circle. And I like to add a light catcher. So I add a little tiny circle in there. And then I color it in. I get away. Yeah? That one? Yeah, I'm looking on my eye. Okay. I like you. Yeah. Then I'm gonna draw some lines for the for the wings. Okay. And little green also has a long tail down here. Long tail. One little foot. And another little foot. Mm -hmm. Lastly, hold on, honey. Hold on. He's got some section here in his What's face. That's two colors. Like a hand. A hand? Yeah. Well, Little Green has wings. Yeah. He doesn't have any hands. Yeah. And a line for the belly. Uh, and a line down here. Oh, that's lovely. Good job. What do you think? Did we do a good job? Mm -hmm. Did we draw a good Little Green? Mm -hmm. Once you're done drawing Little Green, then you're going to Sharpie marker your pencil lines and erase anything that 
you need to erase, like these little lines right here we need to erase. Then we're going to color them with markers. And you can choose green, but you can choose really any color you want. You don't have to make your hummingbird look like little green. You can also make them any colors you like. What colors do you like, George? I like green. You like green? Yeah. Me too. Can you say bye-bye to everybody in the class? Bye. Say bye, kindergartners. Bye, kindergartners. Say Hopefully you're be you be say be good kids for Mrs. for my mommy. All right. Can you wave? Mm -hmm. Bye. Bye. Can you put your hand up high? <laughs> Bye everyone. Bye.